and we're live. Hello, Hi, ladies. Everyone. I'm turning my How's um, everyone my doing? Down. Let's see how long the lag is. I hope it's going to be a long one tonight. There it is. Okay. Yeah. 22. Mine was um, like 19. Oh, you're still going? Uh, so going. Yep. You might have refresh. to you might have to refresh on YouTube. Just refresh your YouTube. I did. Have... <laughs> oh, there we are. Oops. Okay, let's see. Let's do a, a, a roll call here. Hi Lily, hi Sandra, Lorette, Krista, um, Heidi, Jenny, Gigi, Cindy, Gypsy. There we uh, Linda, are. Lydia, oh my gosh, Diane, holy moly, Jean, Eileen, <laughs> Joanne, Colleen. Colleen, Cindy, <laughs> and Michelle. Hi, girls. How's everybody Do you doing? notice right away our desk? Maggie's got <laughs> straight cardboard, and I do not. Just, just saying. <laughs> Well, you've already like really grunged yours up. I just sat here. <laughs> no, this is a pizza box. I didn't do anything to these. <laughs> oh, you didn't? Oh, I thought no, you were. No, this is just a pizza grunging. box. Oh. I drove the bus over. Recreations by Brooke. Hello. Oh, hi, Brooke. Sharon. She, 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 was, she must have been on live and she told everybody to come over here. <laughs> <laughs> thank you <laughs> yes thanks hi cindy and l hi, jamie Harvey. Gigi. jamie okay in case you don't know what we need uh this is um a pizza box so you can care car corrugated cardboard and just we got cheesecloth burlap some ephemera stamps anything your little hands can get your hands on now you want pizza. <laughs> Sorry, Noel. <laughs> I was just going to say, Noel said, now I want pizza. Hi, Kendall. Hi, Miss Kendall. She says, Brooke has been drinking, okay? Eileen. <laughs> <laughs> you know so what I'm going to get, gonna say, Eileen? To get, uh, just to give you a couple ideas of where we're heading. First of all, hi, Joey. Hi, Juliana. Hey, Lorna. We had, hi, Lorna. We had pizza tonight, so I had my grandson rip up the pizza box to challenge me tonight to make things because he ripped these up. <laughs> so we have all different shapes. So this was just a quarter, quarter of a pizza box. So that's what I am working with. I don't know how anybody calls this neat. How can this be considered neat? It's, it's not neat. Look at mine, though. Maggie. <laughs> look at my Maggie and then look at mine. <laughs> <laughs> See, Kendall has a pile like mine. <laughs> Hi, Gita. So, <clears throat> Lorna. Hi, Gita. How are you? Mayor. Mayor. I remember this time. <laughs> So as we're just welcoming everybody, before we just start, oh, Amazon packaging, that's great. We're going to make everything from, like, this is the only one I did when me and Maggie were getting ready. This is just she a stamp. She couldn't herself. I know. <laughs> this is one, two, three different stamps, piece of burlap, piece of material, and a stamp. This is one of my grandson's shapes, and this would either be... A end of a page, like a tuck or a just the end of a page, you know, pocket, or you can use it by itself as a tag. You could cover it with paper if you are using a um, pizza box that has the print on it. You can cover it in coffee dyed paper to write on it. So we're going to have a variety of things. <clears throat> so, and Maggie, what are you going to make with yours? Um, <clears throat> yeah, I mean, <laughs> what'd she say? 
She said it hey, looks Mary. like the cat got a hold of my box. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> and I have a cat, but he's on the he's on the chair sleeping as usual. He's not talking. He hasn't been saying hi lately. Um, I think sure. what I'm going to do is uh, I had started and I had extra pages of Into the Woods. So I started this, but it's just the pages themselves. So what I was thinking is I might try making some ephemera with it. Okay. That because I don't know good. what else I don't I honestly I don't know what else to do with the cardboard. Okay. All right. No, I didn't so. I mean, she said Maggie measured each piece, I bet. <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> All right. So if you haven't already, rip your cardboard. You can rip it like mine, just random pieces like my grandson done did. Or you can go like Maggie and do it straight. Whatever way you prefer. Well, you okay. know, and I then you're going to start take one piece in front of you. You watch. I did watch a video. I did watch a video where um, she showed how easy it was to get the top off, but you have to wet it. And I forgot to do that Hi, before Diane. we went live, and so I figured, well, I can't do it now. So I've been just trying to. <laughs> you go to tear it and just look little little pieces come off at a at a time so and i don't want to take like the whole thing off you're not taking like the whole top off right you're leaving some right now for some reason this pizza box is ripping easy maybe it's a cheaper for i bet you the cheaper ones probably rip easier or maybe yours has more glue on it or something yeah so mine, i'm going to just mine are from the you know used um shipping boxes okay so they, they might have more glue on it might it. be a little thicker next time so the kids is... get pizza i'll tell them save the box if it's not yeah. too, if it's not too greasy <laughs> we can we can um um kendall we can gesso tonight oh gesso oh yeah oh <laughs> no i only have i only have clear i have to save my little container oh. of white gesso for rum <laughs> Michelle's kid. I keep forgetting. Well, I haven't been to Joanne's at, or Michael's, so I keep forgetting to get um, white gesso. But the clear isn't going to do me any good. And don't forget, as we peel some of this off, you can. They also make awesome stamps. This is just a stamp I have, and yeah, that came out really nice. Three different colors of um, ink. <clears throat> So I love that stamp too. That's like, yeah, that's like my favorite stamp of yours. Hi, Lucy. Okay. Use white paint. Hi, Lucy. Yeah, yeah you I didn't can. think of that. Yes, actually, I could use some white paint. So I'm going to start my first one with heavy ink. I would use a dark ink. Oh, I actually so pick out a. Ink. Well, hi, Joy. Welcome. Hi, Joy. Oh, this is my work. I just got out of work a little while ago, Lorna, so I'm all blinged up. <laughs> my husband had pizza oh, ready. And... Mm -hmm. So when I do cardboard, I like to do it really grungy. So I'm, I'm just using vintage photo right now. Oh, we're good, Lorna. It is what it is. But stop raining. Yeah, it's been like that, and it's going to rain here tomorrow, too. Yeah. <clears throat> Hi, Chuck. Hi, Chuck. All right, so we're really going to make this really inked up. And then what I also like to do is on um, cardboard, I'll take my black stays on and carefully ink the edges. Um, get another ink block. Because it, I don't know, it just makes it really stand out. And we'll do some grungy pieces and we'll, we'll do some not grungy pieces. 
If anybody has a stamp that they don't know what to do with, shout it out. And if I have something similar to it, I'd be more than happy to, uh, happy to help you. Hey, Jude. So that is, let me move my leg down. There we go. A little lighter. I don't know if it's. So we got the black and the brown. Did I miss anybody else while well, I went to get my um, my paintbrush? Now let's see. Let see. What are you painting? Oh, look at you. I'm just going to, like, in, I don't have any white uh, gesso, so I'll use some white paint just to make it a little I more. I think I'm going to like that. Sticking off the side like this. Hi, Lucy, if I didn't say hi to you. No, actually, Joey, this would make a good pocket. So we're going to go this way. Because that'll make a good pocket. So once I decide which way I'm going to use it, then you can do... Oh, I have this little number stamp that I like to use. Okay, Kendall, you ink up. I might get some paint out after. I'm not sure. I'm trying to go slow, girls. Hi, Diana. Hi, Diana. And just a little number there. I have just random, like, um, random scripts. I'll use a little brown. Oh, tell me this is dried already. <clears throat> dried. And then what I like to do is we're going to take a little yellow. Hi, Jennifer. Hi, Jennifer. I'm going to put a little yellow in it, and it's very hard to see, but you can see there's a little glow to it, and I usually just put it in the middle, and if I have to, there, now it's glowing, so we just got it a little... Jennifer wants to know what we're making. <clears throat> I don't know what I'm making. A bunch of stuff. But Lori knows. <laughs> we're just having fun with, uh, I'm using a pizza box. And we're making pockets and tags. This is what I made already for an edge of a book journal. Oh, Colleen Hi, made a couple of really cool tags on um, Kathy's live this morning. She used some... Um, they were like crystals or something. Oh, really? Yeah. She used Tim Holtz's new color there, um, that greenish blue color. And then she added some um, rusty car. Oh. Um, I can't think of what the name of it was. And oh, my hmm. gosh, it came amazing. This is just a little piece of... Um... Just some cotton material. I've got little tiny blue flowers. I am going to start my tractor up and just make a little ruffle. Yeah, Eileen, what was the name of what was the name of it though? Um, it's not di dilutions, right? It's I can't think. I couldn't think of it. You just said rusty car. Yeah, that's the color. Oh, Jennifer is going to go to her desk right now and craft along with us. <laughs> nice. So I'm just using a little strip of material. And I'm going to put a, since you're talking about rust, I'll put a rusty pin with it. 
So you don't have to decorate these 100% if you're not sure what you're going to use them for. But I know where my next couple books are going to be, so I'll be using them in there. So something as simple as the ink and a piece of material and a rusty pen. We know how we like rust. And a little stamp. And... I could even, if I wanted to, this little, which I do want to, Paper Artsy Infusions. Yeah, it's called called Infusions, and it's like a, a powder. Hmm. Huh. Yeah, that's because, that's because I cut these off the side of a, um, a, a small shipping box. That's why they look, that's. <laughs> Why they look so, so neat. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Joey, if you're watching, you did a good job on ripping these. Oh, yeah. Hi, Joey. Hi, Juliana. So that's as simple as a stamp, a piece of material, and then, like I said, a pen. And that would go <clears throat> on a page like that. And then I would probably t stick something in there that's blue to pick up the blue to make. Um, um, oh, that's cool. You know, a pocket match. So we got those two. Now let's see. Your thinner cardboard is going to work much better in a journal than this thick stuff here. Yours is thick. <clears throat> Although this isn't as thick as this is thicker. All right, I'm going to stick to this thing. All right, so this is another long, thin one. So let's see what I have in paint. All right, that's too big. Let's see. Oh, oh, I got white paint right here. We'll use white paint since it's here. Actually, I'm going to use white paint. Don't look, Michelle. I'm going to take some ink. <laughs> oh, yeah. Michelle only has five kits left for that. Um, oh, the, for a kit. The book base for um, the lace book, if anybody's interested and if anybody wants to see it I can show it again she has only five left only five left and some of these things that we're making we could use as ephemera in the kit so I just yeah, I got white paint has, and I put a little right. green ink in there so we can lighten this up and make this a shabby one, actually. Hi, Lorette. Did I say hi to you? I can't remember. Maggie, did you like Colleen's condemned stamp? I did. I liked both pages too when she when she was um, finished. I was I was chatting a little, but I was kind of lurking too because I was trying to be good and do some things around here. I'm going to. I'm still going to make. I'd love to see it. Do you mind showing it? No, I can show it. Give me one second. Let me get this on here, and then I'll, I'll bring it out. <clears throat> I'm just going to go around this with the black, just for of an outline. Oh, you're welcome, Colleen. All right. Let me put this aside. Let me grab it. It's right over here. 
I don't know if Maggie has Instagram. Honestly, Maggie, you got Instagram? What's that? Are you talking to me? Yeah, do you have Instagram? What about Instagram? Do you have it? Somebody's asking if you have an Instagram account. Joy. I do. Oh, yeah, I have Instagram, but I hardly ever remember to use it. I don't even know how to use it all. Yeah, I don't. I don't use it too I much. I just started to post it. That's, that's about it. Yeah. Oh, and I can comment on other pictures and that, but as far as like my right, own. So that's just a it's white color. My name. Okay. <clears throat> so the book base is for um well, part of it, for me anyways, is going to be um, using the pages <laughs> to wrap laces. What are you laughing at? Oh, somebody wants a pizza box, she told her husband. But go ahead. I put it on you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, so these, this is how it's going to come. It's corrugated cardboard. There's just so on it. So you can, you can actually do whatever you want with this. But what... what um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use some of these pages for wrapping laces that I'm going to probably hoard for a while. And then there's also these um, pages and she used, these are book pages, but she used more than one page and she um, sewed on them different. Uh, I love this, the zigzag and the straight stitch. Mm -hmm. So yeah, so there's those. So that this is the base of the book, basically. And then there's ephemera. And I had this, I didn't put it back together after showing it um, the other night. So I apologize for it being so messy, but let me just put together so I can put together so you can see. Then there's Thank some you, uh, there's some cardstock pages that you can use to cover up which that's probably what i'll do cover some of it up like that so the, and they're two-sided so you can use whichever side you want and you can use your own too you don't have to use you know it depends if you have a theme going on no, let me keep this together and then there's some just some like pieces uh for ephemera to make tags um this is tissue paper this looks like tim holtz but i'm not positive and i thought this was banana paper but it's not just don't ask me what it is because i don't remember <laughs> <laughs> because anybody that knows me knows that my memory isn't isn't good <laughs> <laughs> Who's on YouTube? Yes, she is Maggie White on YouTube. Oh, Joy oh, okay. was asking. Oh, okay. I thought you were telling me somebody's on YouTube that I said wasn't or something. Then there's a piece of burlap. <laughs> there's some piano paper. There's tickets. You because you can make it into even like a regular journal if you want some library cards and a couple more different tags. So there's that. And then there's some clear gesso and white gesso, just in case you want to add more pages. There's a um, little coin envelope. There's some um, torn muslin, which I love. I love torn muslin. You can stamp on it. You can do a lot of things. This is the most precious thing of the kit, though. This mm. is a piece of a quilt that I'm going to say her great-grandmother made this only because it's hand it's all hand stitched and hand quilted this is all hand done and i know you're probably not going to be able to see it but it's beautiful it's, it's beautiful and um it just got to the point where it it's so old and has seen so many washings and that that she decided um she just couldn't do that anymore so she wants it to go out into the world. Let's put it that way. And, then, and all, all kinds of crafters can um, share. And then there's a packet with 
um, buttons and twine and uh, cheesecloth. And she, Michelle does um, her own glass beads. She does lamp work. And so you'll get some of those, not the same, necessarily the same color though. And, um, and one with the pearl, I forget what you call these little things. So that's the kit, it's a base kit. It's $30, but that includes shipping in the US. So if anybody's interested, you can put it right in the chat and uh, we'll take your name down. And we are, Lori and I are going to do this on one of our Tuesday nights, one or two of our Tuesday nights. And whoever gets the kid, if they want to play along, they can. So that's Very it. Very nice. Very nice. Mm -hmm. I love this. I can't wait to play with it. Mm -hmm. Now, my Maggie was showing you that. <clears throat> what I just were you did doing? <laughs> no, I just did. This is just a piece of the cardboard, the paper. Yep. That I stamped on and colored it. Nice. So, so this is if you don't have a lot of digitals or if you don't have a lot of ephemera, you could still make you could still make things out of stamps, a pizza box, a cheesecloth, and some ribbon. It doesn't have to be um, digis if you don't have them or you don't have access to them right away. So, go back to the painted. And how, oh, Maggie's got some flowers. I love the oh, page. Let's see. Let's this yes. page of the kit. I just, I love these flowers. So, I thought I'd make a couple of um, tags using them. <clears throat> I have some stamps that are shabby. So. If anybody has any questions or want to see something down the cardboard, Shout Let it out there. No. <laughs> <laughs> Let Lori know. <laughs> I mean, I hate to think of how much cardboard I still throw out or put in the recycling. You just can't keep it all. Well. <laughs> Now, now, how Lorna. Cord, how does Cord feel about that? <laughs> oh, geez. <laughs> well, he's out mowing the lawn right under my window. Oh, he is? Yeah, I think he's just finishing up. It's, it's getting dark, so. And it stopped raining for about 10 minutes, so. <laughs> so, I'll just ink this up with a little yellow. I like that glow. Mandarin well, orange. Not any etiquette to cardboard, Laurie? <laughs> yeah, the kid. <laughs> I think. <laughs> <I th> <laughs> yes, I didn't put lace on yet, Maggie. All right, this is yeah, just well, picking I up the little green. I can't. I don't know. I just don't know if lace goes with with cardboard. <laughs> Um, it does, but it, I think you need a, a muslin or a cheesecloth in between it. Make it look like oh, it you, really goes. You, you are so right. <laughs> <laughs> I have some cheesecloth here. Yes, is, he is. No, is well, he is out this harvesting is nice. the crap. This is nice cheesecloth. This is from the UK. They have better cheesecloth mm -hmm. than we do. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> Noel wanted me to correct. He wasn't mowing the lawn. He's out harvesting the crops. Oh, right. I was going to say, did they even have lawn mowers back then? No. He's protecting the crop so. from the, the locusts that will probably come swooping in. <laughs> when it says branding the cows. Hi, Noel. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Not my cord. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> no, he'd be building things. He's not much of an animal person. 
the real life. A cowboy that's oh, not an God. animal person? <laughs> Seriously? Well, you gotta remember, I have two I have the real one and the non real one. <laughs> well, I never know which one you're talking about, so <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's blue. We don't mind blue. <laughs> <laughs> oh my! Plowing and planning. You, yep. You even say good night, Cord, oh, and then I get confused. <laughs> <laughs> oh Lord! <laughs> now know, I'm just right? putting some minding girls. <laughs> <clears throat> This is very relaxing. Well, I'm glad someone's relaxed. <laughs> you haven't made one yet? I mean, you haven't no, made any no, yet? Worry. <laughs> <laughs> Prairie oysters for dinner. What the heck are those? Seriously. And don't say they're cow chips, Lorna. Or buffalo chips or whatever the chips are. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> Did you see? Yeah, we probably a lot skinnier. I know that. I just keep thinking cord board. <laughs> <I know. laughs> oh my gosh, that's funny. Mountain oysters and mountain. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. I'll be eating peach pie. Thank you very much. <clears throat> Nope, 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 nope. Yeah, I'd be very skinny back then. What? I'd be very skinny back then. Oh. Of course, if you didn't know any better, I guess you would eat. Ugh. Gross. I know it, Diane. <laughs> I can't even eat brown uh, avocados. <clears throat> All right, now I'm just making a little bow because we got to do a bow. Okay. How you doing, Maggie? <laughs> oh, I'm fussy cutting right now. Ooh. I have no idea what I'm doing, but. <clears throat> okay, and that's a shabby chic one that could go as a pocket. Actually, you can actually put it like in the middle of your page and then tuck on that side. So that's number four. I'm not counting. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> so that's number four compared to Maggie's half. <laughs> oh, my gosh. That's so funny. <laughs> All right, let's see what can we do with this one. I gotta have a drink of water. I'll I'm take a break. A <laughs> I'm gonna have an asthma right. check. Oh, we're already getting that uh, yellow pollen crap everywhere. Have you got that yet? Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. I didn't think it was usually I this early, but maybe it is. <clears throat> you know, he gave me a couple big ones. So what I'm going to do with this big one is I'm going to take off the, the paper and I'm just going to make a little book out of it. Lona said you're going to have to try to get all kinds of uh, the different foods on the ranch. I'll make believe, Lorna. <laughs> 
Okay, so that would be a cute little book. That could be like something separate, but I have to peel the paper off inside. I'd have to make the leaf too because I don't think I'd like that food. It was so, it and seemed like no it was sugar. so bland. Mm -hmm. I said, it, there's not enough sugar out west. Right. <laughs> I might have to come back. <laughs> <laughs> Can I bring my Splenda with me? <laughs> <laughs> I need to bring my coffee, my curling iron. <laughs> All right. So to make a book, I need to really fold it down like that. Now this could be a cover to a, you could put this on a cover and you could glue this bottom down and you could still make that open. That would be cute. So let's let's fancy this up. Let's slow down so Maggie can catch up. <laughs> oh, I'm never catching up. So you go, girl. <laughs> <laughs> She's over there just dreaming about Colton <laughs> in his dress. <clears throat> about what? Your guy, Colton. Colt. Colton. Yeah, I shouldn't have put name them too close. My oh, two count bad. as one. Now, why is that, Took? <laughs> What's that? Because they're smaller. Took said, my, oh, your two, your two count <laughs> as one. <laughs> oh, I think she's siding with you. It's all right. All right, this is just a piece of canvas, coffee dyed canvas. I think tomorrow, well, if I don't do anything with Angela tomorrow, because it's her day off and she might come over. But if I don't do anything with her and I get some crafting done tomorrow, I think I'm going to start playing with uh, Took's Japanese kit tomorrow. Oh. It'd be pretty. Yeah, I love it. It will be pretty. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. What do I want to put up? I have so many kits I want to work with. I know it in so little time. Right. Of course, I don't know about that. They just canceled just about all our summer events. Because oh, really? Still a COVID. I thought they were oh, my God. Was, like loosening up. Nope. You wouldn't know it here in New York. Nope. They canceled our parade, our symphony. Our... They even canceled things into September. So don't get, I won't get started. So wow. Let's go back to the happy place. Cord is picking me peaches right now. <laughs> I don't, I really don't know what they're doing around here. I mean, the kids are back oh. to school full time. And yet Mason wasn't feeling good. Um, yes. Yesterday when he woke up, he wasn't feeling good. Um, so <laughs> his mom, so Rebecca, you know, let the school know that he wouldn't be in. He was having some stomach issues or something. And do you know they made him go get a COVID test, even though he had no fever, no. Oh yeah. They made him. They made her take him for a COVID test. Yeah. He's only. They do that to my. Yeah. He's only um, thirteen. Yep, they do that to my granddaughter. She's had more COVID tests than anybody. Maddie's had a couple because, you know, she's in high school and. Um, she's had a couple of friends that did come down with it and that yeah, it, they were on the basketball team with her. So she had to get it a couple of times, but so that yeah. I can see, but just because before he could go back to school today, which he did, he went back to school today because he got the test done yesterday and got the results back last night. But because of that, they made him go get a COVID yeah. test. Yeah. I mean, and these are all outside stuff. 
you know, a parade, and it just, I don't know. I know. I don't know. It's getting a little depressing. It just doesn't make sense anymore. Well, no, nothing. just said. Okay, I keep forgetting to look up a chat now. Michigan, Diane said they're canceling a lot in Michigan. South Florida you know, is completely they open. Wouldn't know it in Oregon either. We're in lockdown and even made the national news because of it. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, Florida yeah, is almost 100% open. <laughs> wow. I have relatives that um, live in Florida. <sighs> okay, back to the ranch. Let's go where it's happy. Okay. And you live for a ripe old age of 30. <laughs> 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 Oh, well, <laughs> that's happy. <laughs> <laughs> that means I died 38 uh, years ago. <laughs> <laughs> or I would have oh, anyway. God. Okay. Oh, well, wow. That's one big. Yeah. I don't know that's what else big. to do to this, people. I just don't know. Just don't know. Okay, how many are how many um Kendall, how many do you have? How many did you make so far? I think you were crafting with us, I think. Or anybody? I know it is Lucy and yes. Oh, thanks, Joanne. I have no idea what to do. So I'm just playing. It's just cardboard and paper, basically. So Krista is four on the book. <clears throat> Bye, Joy. Have a nice night. Thanks for stopping. Good night, Joy. Maggie is too straight. <laughs> too damn straight. It's it's what? Um, Eileen says you're too damn straight. <laughs> uh. I'm, I'm eating. Trying. Two, Trying but one I mean, is, is on the cover of a journal. It's hard. I'm so used to doing things one way. Okay, Noel. <laughs> I'm working on a journal cover as Luna's well. Luna's always eating. <laughs> <laughs> Lori, is your cardboard thin enough? to put your pieces on pockets that would be cute i think so i can make it thin enough maggie rop the sides what's rop mean rip rope. maybe she means rip oh rip tear it renee we're just like making you with your wood themed journal oh oh okay. that's true I, I know what you mean okay I'm pulling out my pretzel bag. How's that? I am making 12 by 12 master collage boards. Oh, those and me do not get along. Yep. <clears throat> Rest in peace. <laughs> Eileen, you crack me up. Hi, Kim. <laughs> Hi, Kim. She's in uh, Oregon, too. I didn't know it was so bad there. Looking better? Thanks, Eileen. Okay. I 
right, so it's staying with the theme. I'm just going to go with brown paper bag and just put a couple pieces in there. And they're just going to be rips. Okay, Lorna, when was cardboard invented or used? Kim, this is your first live watching, really? Oh, she's eating corn on the cob. Hard to type. <laughs> right, if you get down with the corn, then you can look that up. All right, so this is just a little, isn't that cute? Just a little cardboard. Oh, let me pink. Wait a minute. Oh, yeah. And this is all with a card or with a pizza box and some embellishments. And then we'll just, I'll have to sew it in after, but. There, so that's just a little cardboard book. Just the, and you can gesso it if you want. You can, I got a little white paint here. You know, you can just hit it with a little white paint here and there. This is Kim's first live. I'm Welcome, Kim. Yeah. All right, let me see if I can do something with these. <clears throat> the first cardboard, or more paper board, was invented in 1817 in England. Okay, so. Cool book, Lori. Thank you, Eileen. <laughs> what? Because I turned around and grabbed my pretzel bag, and there she is, done with the cover. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a cute, just a cute little book. These would be good to give even as a little card, something that you can write in. So there's a little good, cute little book. I'm just trying to I'm still trying to get my grunge on. At least you rip. <clears throat> At least what? I said it's ripped. Oh. I thought you said at least. No, it looks cute. Oh, I keep dropping in the paint. So we have a book. We have two side pockets. We have another pocket. We have. All right. Let's see. Let's see what else my grandson ripped up. I really like making the tall, thin ones. I have no idea where anything is. Oh, there it is. Thank you. Yeah, it might be a little thick. <clears throat> and probably in a folio it might go. Right, this is another big one. All right, since this is kind of big, and this, he ripped the cardboard off. I'll just finish ripping it off. And he left the paper attached. So what we can do, ooh, a paper clip. I'll do that next. What we can do on something like this would be making, oh, let's see. Let's cut some flowers out. Oh, thanks, Lorna. Yeah, that could be a corner pocket. I just have to take like a layer off the back though, because it's I think it's a little too thick, but I could do that. Thanks, Diana. Whoop. But I only make them when I'm sitting here doing the live to make so many of them. Now here I'm going to put flowers behind this because this is going to be...
Huh. <clears throat> or is the making clean? I was thinking my husband, if he was really a rancher or a cowboy, mm -hmm. my daughter and I had alpacas and we helped shear them. Oh my God, if that was trying to hold these animals down. Yeah, I wish I had that on video. <laughs> oh, I wish you did and they, too. <clears throat> and they like to spit. Oh my God, they're nasty when they don't want to be sheared. And you got to be really careful of their long necks. And she only had four of them. We felt like we did twenty-five of them. <laughs> what did she? What did she do with the um, the, the fiber? Yeah. Um, we tried to make things that didn't go too well. To make yarn, I used to with the hats. I felted hats, and actually, I uh -huh. actually sewed a couple. But the fibers were so fine, they got, every time I worked with them, I got some kind of um, bronchitis or something, even if I wore a mask, oh, and it just really? wasn't worth it, because you really had to no. be, yeah, because it's kind of wool, so if you have any allergy or anything to it. Right. <clears throat> I mean, it's a fiber, so. Yeah, it wasn't, <clears throat> didn't work out so hot. Yeah, okay, this is done. All right, so this is going to be. Let's see if I can take a layer off so I can make that into a pocket. I'm just loving these shears. <laughs> We're going to have a bird there. <clears throat> <clears throat> so, on something like this, I would almost. Well, no, I will glue it to this. Maggie, that's beautiful. Well, thank you. I'm trying to thin it out a little bit so I can use it as a pocket. Whoops. Nope, that's all <laughs> I'm gonna glue the front of these. Oh, before I do that, I need to grunge this up. Do you really want the contrast? Maggie's table is still clear. Come on, Maggie, get some garbage around you. <laughs> yeah, but if you knew this is the only area I have to work with. Everything else is covered with stuff. <laughs> this is all I have. <laughs> Ooh, I think this is going to come off. I yes. So we have a little. This is going to be yes. a little. I did it. Awesome. Now that can be a pocket. Look at that. There's my little. Let's see. It will look nice in that little journal you just made. Yeah. I'm giving it texture and a little. <clears throat> I wrote a bowl once. It was mechanical, but I wrote it. <laughs> <laughs> I was young. <laughs> Where did that come from? <laughs> oh, I mean, at a rodeo, Lori rides the bulls and Maggie walks the what? Oh my gosh. Maggie <laughs> and I said, I rode a bull. <laughs> the ponies? <laughs> Thanks, Eileen. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so funny. <laughs> Hi, Glenna. I rode a cam I rode a camel <laughs> once and it was real. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think I think I rode an elephant in a circus, you know, around the parking lot. 
yeah no we we have a, a well, no. new towns over we have a um a really large it's not really a zoo it's um it's what do they call it it's an animal i forget what they call it but anyways it's huge and um one year we took uh maddie and mason when they were little maddie was about three years old and she wanted to go on the camel and nobody <laughs> else would go on <laughs> So I said, okay, I'll get, she says, grandma, will you come on with me? I said, okay, I'll, I'll come on. <laughs> so we rode the camel. Oh my gosh, those things are nasty. I know. <laughs> they really are. All right. I think I'm going to put on this one. And that kind of, okay. That's going there. <clears throat> Camels are so scary. I rode one in India and I rode an elephant. They are scary, Lorna, even with the guy you know, yeah. in the rings and everything. I swam with dolphins. It's as crazy as I get. That was Diane. I mean, I mean. <laughs> what would she say? She cracks me up. I, <laughs> oh, Eileen, I just love you. <laughs> All right, it's going to be a tough spot here. Come to Florida, you can swim with dolphins all the time. <laughs> yeah, my daughter, my daughter swam with dolphins. We went to um, the Bahamas for one of our spring breaks when she was in college. And uh, that's all she wanted to do was, was uh, swim with the dolphins. Oh, my God. She loved no, it. I, didn't do, I don't do a lot mm. of the ocean stuff. Yeah, I watched while she swam. All right, now I need something to make sure that I can actually put something behind that. Let me see here. Do I have any tags left? I think I used all the tags in the in the other journal. Maybe I can use this. Oh yeah, that'll fit good. All right, this is just a packet that's got flowers glued behind it. That's pretty. So I just glued the flowers behind it. And that would make, I would concentrate on like, tucking something behind there. And then mm -hmm. the little stamp. But I, I'm Chevy basically blend. using the same things I have on my desk in a different way. Nice. So. <clears throat> We got that. Somebody knew we got the little bluebirds. So I got one, two, the sun, the girl, three, then another side one with the stamp and painted. Then we got the little book. I like the little book. Thank you, Jenny ladies. The pocket. And then that's just the paper. Okay, what else can we do? Uh, let's see. Oh, somebody mentioned paper clip. <clears throat> paper clips are easy if you can get it in between. Let's get some big ones. Ooh, I also got some tea bags. Really? I don't have another big paper clip. Nah, I'm going to have to go little. All right, let's see. 
right, I'm going to rip that off, Joey. See which way the lines are going. All right, so we're going that way. So I would just tuck this right in. All right, so that ain't going anywhere. So I would just rip that. Rip this. And crap. I mean, darn it. I didn't mean to rip that, but we'll cover it. No biggie. We don't want any nice edges. Unless you're Maggie. <laughs> <laughs> you just had to put that in there, right? I did. I did. <laughs> you're too neat. You're killing me. <laughs> okay, we're going to do that. I, I know. I can't. I, and believe me, I don't try to be, but it's like I can't help myself. Well, that's just it. And I can't help myself yeah. being a slob. <laughs> so there's a tuck. As my husband would say. I put a couple little um, ticket type things in there that can be used as journaling. And that piece there. So that's kind of like a little uh, collage -y type of thing. Oops, I'm not even yeah. Playing. Yeah, I know I like what we that. can do. It. <clears throat> Hi, Renee. So, Thank you. a little edgy. Don't be a troublemaker, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I'm going to get into this paint, so I better just use that. Uh, thanks, Tuck. And thank you, Joanne. Okay. So I could do, but All right, we're just go gonna let them dry. Do the same thing. Kind of. Now another fun okay. thing we can do. Is we're gonna I'm gonna rip the back off because it's got the pizza box. The pizza was okay, very good. By I'm not a slob, Lori. You are a creative artist. Oh, thank you. See that? Sometimes Cord doesn't think so. <laughs> the real life Cord. <laughs> As he went, he went one night, he went to go to bed and he, he went to kiss me goodnight and he couldn't even get to me because they had so many papers in between the two of us. <laughs> All right, so you can also just punch holes. I'm randomly. I should have used a different one, two, three. And Joey, I'm still using your tag, just a little differently, buddy. But you should be in bed now. <laughs> yeah, if he made something before he went to bed, you, you need to post it so we can see what he made. Oh, no, he was just, he just ripped the cardboard for me. Oh, he just ripped the, oh, I thought you said he, I thought maybe yeah. he um, yeah. no. had taken some home and he was going to. <clears throat> and then you could just put it on a ring and I'll decorate him. But these are cute to hang on a spine of a book if you wanted to do um, these are just cute so let's just decorate them and I'll think about that alright so if I'm going to make three for spine I want them semi not the same but um, kind of Oops, what do I see over in this little pile? Oh, this little boy. Okay, change of plans. We're going to put a hole in him. I don't want to put a hole in his head. And 
And then we'll get some cheesecloth. So these are nice backing for a cabinet card. Yeah, I, I love the rings, Lorette, but I just, a lot of times I forget about them and they're sitting right in front of me. I like the ring. I like the tags with the rings on them or vice versa. So we can put that bit like that. Thank you. Maggie's being out. Listen, Maggie is ripping over there. I think. Yeah, but I don't know. I I have I don't know what I'm doing. <clears throat> <laughs> You're not comfortable with them. Feel the rip, Maggie. I don't want it to look like wow. the other one. I don't want oh. it to look like the other one, so yeah, I'm going to I'm going to cover this up. <clears throat> See if this works. Okay, so next time you spend $20 on a pizza, you're not going to feel so bad because just think of all the things you can make with the box. Right? Because I don't know about you guys, but pizza went up around here too. <laughs> now I had, let's see. <clears throat> I don't know what it is around here. My son usually gets it, so. I'm going to put this stand. Cool. And then we'll just ink it up a little. Leave some of it peeking out. So here's my ring, so we can put that one on there. Well, thank you, Lorna. And let's see what else. For inspiration, Meg, you need this? What's that? For inspiration, do you need this? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Just in case. Yeah, yeah send them over. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Do I have in this area? You know what I do have are these. This is a picture, but it's too big. These are pictures that are local to my area. Um, where's this? Some of these, not all of them. Let's just do something like this. Paper wrapping. We'll use them on these two. Lorna said. Glory, that little guy is super cute. 
Is that yours, Lorna? Because I can't remember this if it was your cabinet card. He is really cute. Oh, welcome back, Gigi. He is cute. Mm -hmm. Hello, Gigi. Getting... So I broke down okay. and ordered some um, art glitter glue today. You did or are you reading that? No, I broke down and ordered some online oh. on Amazon. Oh, you know, cool. freaking expensive. It is, it is. But I really, everybody just raves about it, so I really want to try it. And um, when I was showing the video of uh, Into the Woods, it wasn't, at first I said it was a piece of glassine, but it wasn't. It was like um, butcher paper or, you know, uh, uh -huh. jelly paper. And yeah. I had put a um, pocket or some or a tuck spot and it was coming off and I had used um, Fabri-Tac. So I said, well, I'm gonna have to think, I'm gonna have, maybe I'll use double-sided tape or something. Well, somebody that watched it um, sent me a comment and said, use the art glitter glue. Yeah, uh, it, which is kind of strange because I just ordered it last night. So I'll answer her and say it's in the it's. I was going to say in the mail, but it's in the, not mail. In the mail. It's in the um, <laughs> Amazon truck right now. <laughs> it is nice stuff. It really is. I and I like the fine like tip it comes with. Well, yeah. So I ordered. I think it's only like a like one ounce or two ounces but it's yeah it's not big so then i ordered an eight ounce refill to refill go with yeah it. but i'm not going to use it like for everything because wow that's stuff Well, hello so got these. from the UK. Hope you are all well. Ring life of life of art. Do you have a hello. first name? You want to Welcome. We're having fun with cardboard in a pizza box. Are we? Is it fun yet? <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> no, I I am. <laughs> I am having fun. Is this as bad as collaging for you, Matt? <laughs> um, well, it's just, to me, it's just a smaller, much smaller scale, actually. So what are you, you having trouble with? Just the I, raw I edges know. or the ripped edges? I don't know. Just... Until like I get stuff down, then I I'm just never sure of like what I'm doing. Well, do it your so way. I, do it with um. I don't lace always stuff. know what to add on to it. That's too big. Barely art precision, precision craft glue. What's that? Is that in the U.S., Kim? She's saying different kind of blue. Yeah. Oh, I, I saw that on Amazon too. That was expensive too. Is it like similar to the um to the art glitter glue? Michelle said the nice part is it I've never heard of it. Glue to work well. Yeah, I noticed that. I mean, the tip looks even finer than the um, Sugar Bell bottle tip. Oh, hi, Safina. Wow, you're seeing people that I don't even see. I'm, I'm on, um, I'm watching the YouTube chat. Maybe it hasn't. 
gotten in the stream yard no. chat yet? No. Took Kim. Don't buy on Amazon. That's the only place I could find it, Took. And um, Lorna said that's it. not her kit. Apparently, it dries a touch slow than art glitter glue. You can also buy it from their website. Oh, okay. Oh, and it comes in a bear-shaped bottle. Cute. Oh, that is, that is cute. All right. I want to take these. Just use the... This I know is shabby dabby doo dah her ad kits. <laughs> she was supposed to be Earth heading, is life is art, supposed to be heading to bed. 1.47 a.m. there, but noticed the live, so thought I'd stop in for a beat. But oh, yeah. nice. I think that's Safina. I think that's who they're calling Safina. Maybe. Oh, okay. Because let me go up and chat. I don't think there's, I see, saw anybody that was named Safina. Unless I missed Yeah, we don't have any local. local. Oh, she said, my name is Safina. What a pretty oh, name. It is. I guess I got to read better. Do you have your glasses on? No. It'd be too easy. <laughs> <laughs> Michelle Rowe, yes, Maggie. Whatever you asked. Yes, Maggie? What did I don't know? I don't, I don't know. I don't know what she's answering <laughs> us to. Come on, Michelle, I got to keep up. <laughs> oh, maybe she was talking about um, that. That's Safina. Oh, maybe. I'm going to cut this little bottle out. if I can make this work. Oh, just confirming the name match. <clears throat> yeah, that's what happens when I don't, uh, when I forget to look up a chat. I have glitter glue, scotch glue, brain glue, fabric tack, and barely glue. Gotta have different glues. Yeah, I never oh, heard of the barely glue. I just I saw that on Amazon when I was looking for the um, the art glitter glue. It came, you know, it was another like recommendation. Oh yeah, I used. I never um, heard of it oh. before either. What was it? What did I use that? I want to say it had lizard in it. It was a glue and rept. Yeah, no, not lizard. Reptile. <laughs> Reptile. Gorilla glue. No. Now is that a reptile? <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, it was reptile. Oh my god, I just snorted. <laughs> Reptile glue. The first time I used it was awesome. The second time I used it. <clears throat> um it was thin as can be. I don't know what the hell happened to it. But it was just not even worth buying it. So I don't know if it was a bad batch or what was going on with it. Well, you saw what happened to my um Eileen's tacky glue, remember? Oh, yeah. That got really thick. Didn't it? Like, really? Yeah. 
It looked like moose. Hi, Leah. Reptile, premium craft, reptile. Dry premium craft adhesive. Two ounce dries clear, order and ship above freezing. Yeah, see, that's like the art glitter glue. They won't even ship it yeah. in the wintertime. <clears throat> but it just didn't work as good. Hi, Leah. Oh, what did you do? Or is it what kind Leah? of glue? Oh, best glue ever Leah. is awesome. What is the best glue ever? Barely? No, the best glue ever is, is another one. And I forget where they're out of. I think they're here in the U.S., but they won't ship um, in the wintertime either. There's something well, what is it? What's the name of it? It's called the best glue ever. And what's the name of it? The best glue oh. ever. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I thought you forgot the name. Oh boy, I'm just gonna craft. <laughs> oh my gosh, never even heard of that one. The best whoever. And what is that compared to, Gigi? <clears throat> That's and that. Well, glue, hello, Miss Patty. Glue, that glue is wicked expensive. <coughs> Hi, Patty. Wow. The best glue ever? <laughs> yes. It's it's even more expensive <laughs> really? than our glitter glue. Wow. Patty was busy sorting and organizing. Lost track of time. Oopsie. I thought maybe you were resting. Yes, All right, Arlene so we got our refuses, refuses to lose to use fabric tack and Aileen's glue. She refuses flat out. Why? I have no Why, Miss Aileen? <clears throat> I'd be lost without my glue. And I would not rely on hot glue gun too much. Oh, good night, committee meeting. Oh, good night. Good luck. It is crappy glue. Okay. Is that the name of it? <laughs> I'm just kidding. What's it called? <laughs> she said it's crappy glue. <laughs> What's crappy glue? <laughs> I don't know. I think I lean <laughs> or I I don't know. Oh, oh, the Aileen's and the fabric tack. Oh. Okay. Oh, I love that. All right, so that's the tags. Roughly, you know, what I got in my desk. So you have just a... Yeah, how many a picture did you that, like, Come on. I know you're not I mean, counting, but... I mean, a many? set of three. Three tags. Uh -huh. Yeah. And I made a corner. Yeah. And then I made a pocket with bluebirds. And then I made a flowers with orange or peach roses. <laughs> a pocket that, that would oh, go those are pretty page. Look at you getting your shabby on. Then I made a little book. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's just a stamp. Eight. And nine. And this is still with a quarter box of a pizza box. I still can't. I'm amazed at how much I got out of that. Right. Patty said um, yeah. everybody has to send Eileen a, a um, sample size of uh, Fabri-Tac. <laughs> well, I see you say no, no, no. <laughs> Gigi just tore yeah, up her cardboard. <laughs> no, no, no. Thank you. 
And now I have two paper. And Maggie, show us what you did. Hold on. Let me finish gluing down. See, she did more in depth things. And then I got the paper clips. We'll decorate these little paper clips. Let's do them in. What do I have here? So Eileen, Eileen, Eileen. Eileen. What do you use? Pepperoni, Gigi. My husband only gets pepperoni pizza. He doesn't even ask me anymore. <clears throat> and I pick it off and fling it at him. <laughs> <laughs> I do. <laughs> well, we've been doing that for 37 years. If I had my pizza the way I wanted, it would be with, I think we had the discussion in it. I like mushrooms and peppers and fresh tomatoes. I like, and I like Hawaiian pizza. That's right. That's where that came from. I knew we had this discussion. Oh, she only sews the fabric on. If you can't, she said, if I can't sew the fabric on, I don't use it. Oh, really? Wow. But... Eileen, I've seen some of your tags and all that. What do you use to um, put all that down? Matte medium? Gel medium? Inquiring minds want to know. Lorna, the pizza shop was hot off the brick oven. That was the name of it. We have a lot of local pizza shops. Matt like a new one okay. opens up every other week. <clears throat> I had a feeling that was going to be your answer. I just had this pesto pan. shrimp pine nuts. Ooh, that sounds good. I got glue all over. I haven't even jostled tonight. You should be proud of me, Michelle. See, it goes in spurts. Sometimes I'll be jostling everything in sight. And then I seem to be right now into stamps. And what else am I into? <clears throat> See, I don't know. Those are so cute. I don't want to cover them up. <clears throat> How you doing, Meg? Oh, look at her. She's got a whole journal done. No, I don't. <laughs> oh, you surprised I tried, me. I think this is too thick to, you know, just to hold it down. So I'm trying to just to give it a little bit of a chance to, to dry. See if it'll there. I think that's okay. All right. Give me another minute and then I'll show you what I got accomplished. <clears throat> Just don't expect Lori, Lori amounts. <laughs> I love as long as they can get an idea Lori. from. <laughs> I love this, so I hate pepperoni. <laughs> I like the flavor of pet of pepperoni. I just don't like to eat it unless it's pepperoni and cheese. But I don't like cooked pepperoni, I should say, on a pizza. Yeah, you like it just um, cut up like room temperature? or Yeah, cold? if we're at a party, mostly if you're at a party or something, they have pepperoni and cheese, I'm not going to turn it down. I like super sad, better, the Italian, Italian sausage.
Facebook. What's that mean, Lorna? Or Phoebe, FB. FB, FB. Be back? No. What's FB mean? Facebook? That's what I thought. Okay, Good night, Gypsy. Went, Good night, Gypsy. Patty, what are you owing? She went, oh. Pizza. I need new Pizza. contacts. I don't see any convo about stamps, Lorna. Oh, I see. She's talking to Patty. Okay. I mean, this is just simple um, paper clips, but by inking the cardboard, see the darkness and then the lightness, they're just pretty, I think. So that's they paper clips. I think Krista wanted to see them. And if you want, well, I would definitely ink the backs up. But by sticking them right in the corrugated cardboard, I didn't even have to glue them. So those are cute. And I still have, man, I think it grew. I still got all this left. Um, um, did we do it? We didn't do a packet that would go on like, <coughs> this side of the page. So that would go down. Okay, I'm done. Like done for the night. <clears throat> What's that? Like done for the night. Um. Well, I'm done playing with cardboard. <laughs> <laughs> I got two. I, me, I think we broke her. <laughs> yeah, we broke I, her. I did finish two. Tuck spot, so I'm happy. I did this one, which you already saw. That one there. And then I did this one. Whoops. Right there. These are very pretty. And they fit in your book? What? And they fit in the book? Yeah. Yeah, this doesn't have a lot of pages. It only has like this only has 16. I think I'm going to use it like as a, um, I'll keep it for like a, um, an insert. Uh huh. It's bigger than, see, it's, it's too big. It's bigger than the, uh, into the woods. See the difference in the sizes. So I can't really. I mean, I could put them together that is as pretty. two separate, you know, two separate things. I could, I yeah. guess, I could do that. Yeah, I could just keep them together. But I want to add keep some. Them, different. Yeah. I just love these, you know, the images. I don't. Yeah, they're pretty. I don't want to cover them all up. You don't you have know? to. Yeah, I know. Oh. They're so pretty. Look at that. You don't need to do anything. I love the mushrooms. And Kendall so made I might four. Put like a couple of journaling things, but but not like um, adhere them to the pages. I'll use uh, paper clips or something and put them on the side. That's what I'll do. Okay. Oh, thanks, okay. Diana. But I'll add a couple more. Well, I'll add like, um, like a couple of actual pockets on the bottom of a couple of these, and then, mm -hmm. like I said, I'll put something on the side. But I'll I'll pin it. I won't. Hi, Tamar. I won't glue it down. Hi, Tamar. 
Thanks, everyone. I know the mushrooms, right? Whoops. Yeah, see, this is thick. We're going to have to fix that. So, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. So, I think... Um, I can't see using any more uh, card, you know, cardboard in there. I guess if I could get it a little. You can thinner, even layer this. I could actually make a couple, you know, I could make two. Well, I guess maybe it would stick with the theme if I could make two regular pockets rather than tucks with the um, cardboard. Yeah. That's what I should do. But I need to get it thinner because it's just too thick. <clears throat> yeah, I definitely try pizza box. I think those are cheaper. Now this packet, I just put in. I had this little button card, and then I just hooked the paper clip over it. So I just layered. Yeah. You can do that too. And then you have it instant little pocket and it can go like something like that and then you can you can put a that's kind of big say a little um envelope in like that oh that's pretty so i mean just because the colors kind of are the same hue that if you if you're a matchy match person, which I usually am to some degree. So that's that. And I did, if you notice, oh yeah, I did use some people. No, I was yeah, just a no stamp. Mouth, mouth, Krista. I'm trying. Oh, I like my alligator mouth. I'm trying. I mean, you could still, you could put these on beds. You can put these on. Oh, let's see. Do I have any small, have these small, tiny little tea bags? Yeah, these are small. I don't know what I was thinking when I bought these. I think I was. Bye, Jenny. Good night, Thank Jenny. Cook. Right, ink it up. I'm going to try this. I don't know if it'll work. Well, if you have tea bags, like I do, because I bought a whole crap load of them. Of tea bags? Yeah, and they're, yeah, and they're tiny. Like, what size are they? Two and a half by... Two. I guess if you wanted to put, see, for again, it would be more texture. I think Maggie's ripping again. Yeah, I was trying to take some more card um, off that cardboard. But I think it's the good night, Miss Lorna. <clears throat> good night, Lorna. Thank you for helping. Just got to be careful that it doesn't glue it shut together. Hope this helped the little girls with some ideas for cardboard. That's what I do with that. Okay, now let's have some ideas for next Tuesday night. <laughs> well, we should be doing. Is it next Tuesday? Is um, Michelle's kit? Well, I I don't know if everybody will have their kits by then. Okay. 
Hi, Jane oh, Beth. A little She's in the UK too. Let's. Hey, Jane. I didn't even see Jane. Welcome. Beth. <clears throat> welcome. Welcome. Did, oh, I would say, is Gita here? She's still here. You're still up late. I think she's still here. She stays up late. I'm going to have to let this dry. Put a couple of clocks up here. Those mushrooms look like they have booties on. They do. <laughs> Krista says that. Hi, Debbie B. I forgot you were live tonight. So glad I caught you. Hi, Debbie. Lovely to meet you, too. We're usually here every Tuesday. <clears throat> Try to come up with some new ideas. Yeah. Does anybody have any? <laughs> Gita's original night owl. Okay, and then I'll just like maybe punch a number down here. More grunge Maggie needs to practice. <laughs> <laughs> Who's that? I'm okay. enjoying oh, doing no. the grunge. There's just certain things, you know. I kind of have different ways to use into. buttons. Oh, different <laughs> ways to use buttons. I don't know, Kendall. That's something a hard with, one. Something with lace and buttons. Altered envelopes. Journal or ledger papers. Now ledger papers would be fun to work with cardboard to, to um they add, I like this string on these and maybe I tie a bow in them. Let's just make a bow. Now nah, I don't like it. No more My, no cardboard next week. Who said that? I just did. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <clears throat> okay. So I guess I could just put this on a packet if you wanted to take your paper clip off, paper clip, and then just put, you can do that too. I mean, you could do whatever you want. Yeah, just like that. <laughs> I don't care. I love watching both of you ladies. Well, thank you, Diana. Uh, Page trims like ruffles and seam binding thingies. <laughs> Suggestion. Okay. Crafting with book pages, make pockets, embellishments, clusters, altered journal pages, inked, and decoupage. Oh, we could do that. Secret hidden pockets. Fold out and flip ups. <laughs> Kendall. Really? <laughs> I think so, Patty. Suggestion. Crafting with book pages. We haven't crafted with book pages in a while, but I'm just. No, we haven't. Actually. We can kind of hidden pockets with book pages. I like the hidden pockets. 
because I like doing that. Yeah, I like. I kind of like that idea too. I'm gonna write it down. Pages. <laughs> right. What What are you laughing at? Yeah. Uh, let's see. Let me find the pan. We could Good make grief. um hidden pockets using book pages, and well, that's not gonna work. <sighs> Just bought a new Sharpie today. What is that green? Is it, are gonna know that? All right, we'll do book pages. <laughs> God knows that enough. Book pages. Make little book pages with make little journals with only book pages. Oh, the rat, that's mean. How could I not put coffee dyed paper in that? Right? Okay, the rat, what else can we use besides book pages? Are you challenging us? All right, book pages, hidden packets. Hidden packets. Hold down the hmm. fort. I'll be okay. back in a minute. Okay, Miss Maggie. <clears throat> I like the little journals, but with only book pages. Add coffee dyed paper. Okay. <laughs> like the idea. Hidden packets. All right. We'll do book pages in mini mini books with them. Is that what Lorette said? Make little journals. Yeah, little journals. And hidden pockets. Rice paper. I don't have any rice paper. I don't know if Maggie does. It's one thing I don't have. What do you do with waterlogged book and magazine pages? I don't know, because mine are in the dumpster. <laughs> so... <laughs> New nope, money long gone. Make the cover and most of the items with some pages with book pages. Hmm. I have to get some of my good book pages out. And ledger papers, pages. I'm eating Reese's Pete. Reese's Thins. <laughs> Must be the sugar. <laughs> Do you have waterlogs and magazine pages, Miss Michelle? <laughs> I know it. The rice paper is so pretty. I had one piece and it's not enough to do anything with. I just look at it. Parchment paper instead of rice paper. Um, hi, Judy. <laughs> Use them. That way you get to get more. That's what I thought, Michelle. But I thought somebody else's. <laughs> yep, no, mine are in the dumpster. Long gone. <laughs> well, not long gone, but. Another suggestion. Franken. Oh, no, 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 no. Life is art. We had a collage night and it did not go well. Me and Maggie tried to do a collage board and it just wasn't pretty. <laughs> we might, maybe we'll try again, but <laughs> it wasn't good. <laughs> Our pages weren't sticking. It was too thick. Neither one of us knew what we were doing. And it was. <laughs> Let's see, where else are we? Another suggestion, Franken pages, master boards. I think, um, somebody had an idea, and I must have met, I read it on one of the, um, I don't know, Facebook pages, to do a master board, but to do it skinny, to do it long and skinny, which I might be able to do. Say we did it like this, and then you would just cut or cut this way, 
if it was already getting ready to pre-cut, I think I wouldn't have a big problem with it. But I think our problems were we didn't know where to cut and where to start stop our art and it, it was just oh dear <laughs> oh. but maybe if we do it in a different form can you get rice paper easily in the u.s yes there is different sites thank you patty New ways to do covers. Oh. Hmm. New ways to do covers. Uh, what about the beautifully large decorated envelopes you used to make? I still, but I, I think I used to make them with music paper. I probably ran out of the the big one and I haven't found any or I I should say it's hidden somewhere in my mess and I haven't come across it because that's how sometimes I craft I of what I what I find in my um, stash at the time and then I use it up and then I'll go find something else. Maggie when you were gone we were talking about doing a master board again collage but uh -huh. long and skinny like this so you're, you kind of already have a vision of where you want to cut it. All right. <laughs> I don't board think on, on board. cardboard. No, no, just something long and skinny versus the big wide ones. Oh, somebody was doing that with book pages. Only she was lining them up. I can't think of who it was. Who, who did I see doing that? She was lining them up, you know, going across rather than, you know, in a square. I don't think it was I don't know. Joey. I, oh, I don't know. But then I would be I willing to try Joey. something like that before I would do another master board because that wasn't my thing. Paper ruffles are really, really easy, Took. Oh, Rock yeah, the Creations could, we just... Could, um, like, we could do collaging on um, books you know, book papers and that way there it stays a reasonable um what do you call it? Size. You know, reasonable space. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah. What do you think about that? Well, I think we no. got a lot of ideas and I think I just ripped up my book. Oh no. I got <laughs> book pages, <laughs> hidden pockets, and a little journal. No, took one to see them. Took, do you sew? Do you sew your paper ruffles? Or do you glue them? Because this is, I'm just folding them ruffle style. Okay, look it. And then you can either, um, oh. Sew them or glue them. And I make them all different sizes. I really like to use the um, uh, pattern paper. Those make really awesome ruffles. Sewing paper. Yep, that's what I meant. Sewing Thank you, paper Patty. ruffles. Yeah. Yeah, I love that. Yep. Patty, who are you? I, do you I, think I, I'm using the wrong print setting or the wrong rice paper she was asking somebody if they printed on oh. rice paper oh okay oh it must be shauna i've never done that i have enough trouble just print no i haven't either hmm talk maybe you're making them too wide or not wide enough i don't know how big yours are you gotta send me a picture Send me a What's picture of your ruffle and paper, she says her ruffles ruffle? don't come out like mine. Yeah. The paper ruffles? Yep. Yeah, there's a there's a couple different ways of doing those, right? Yeah. Yeah. You know, folding I mean, it and then right. Folding it. 
did I just cut that off? Folding it and then, um, you know, sewing it, you know, folding, kind of folding yeah. the ruffles. Like these, these bags are really fun to do too. Let's see. What kind of bags? This is just um, a bag I got at a local store. I bought some jeans. I bought some jeans that are a size too small because I swore by the end of summer I'm getting into them, darn it. And the jeans are three bucks. So I couldn't pass them up. They can't button right. them. <laughs> so we got to work on it. All right, I take my rough bone, start at the top, and just bend up. And I don't even worry if there's space in between. And that's when I really, that's the best mm -hmm. I do for measuring. Hey, Esme. Hi, Debbie. Hey, Esme. So you got a ruffle like that that I would sew. Now, the ones that you might be referring to, now that I think about it, Another challenge could be to make things the, using the items on your table or scrap box if you keep one. We did that what? one night, didn't we? Um, Safina said another challenge could be to make things using only items on your table or scrap box if you keep one. Hmm. We did that a while ago, right? Yeah. I could probably Am make a, a lot of stuff off my floor. <laughs> Well, I have a whole dining room table here, so I mean, right. I could cover you it with can... everything. So that wouldn't really be fair. <laughs> this one took, and maybe this is the one you're talking about. I just gather it up like I do. I'm just pinching it. I'm not even folding it. And that's kind of my messy one that I do more with the um, pattern paper. I can just squash it up. So maybe that's the one that you're probably thinking of. Because those come out different all the time. Gigi, I'm going to do it. I got my water right here, right next to my peanut butter cups. <laughs> no, <laughs> just kidding. I actually had a cinnamon bun. <laughs> I did have a cinnamon bun, and it's giving me odds, though. <laughs> See, I shouldn't have took I shouldn't have ate it. Yeah, that's just your you're squishing it all up like that, and then, or I'll squish it this up underneath my sewing machine. So try that, but try it with the sewing paper first because it's easier to. Or even the parchment paper is easy too. Hi, Judy. Yes, I do like them too, um, Judy. Patty says, that settles it. I'm just going to go live soon and print so I can try all the suggestions in real time. There you go. We'll jump over to you, Patty. <laughs> okay, so, oh, it's took no problem. Well, tomorrow is my four week, and I'm happy to announce I lost a total of, oh, my goodness, as nice. man, I'm so proud. Nice. All right, that's that. I'm starting so not tonight. tonight, like the next few days, LOL. Oh, okay. You said it again, not tonight. <laughs> yeah, I guess that would be a better one. See, that's your, your, your neat is a little more. And sometimes I'll even sew it on a curve just because I like that. Or you can do it this way. So. All righty. You just about. Done. I don't know. I think I'm cardboard out too, Max. Yeah. yeah, I can't think of anything else. 
I'll put my All stuff right, so on what, the table. What should we do next week? Try the hidden, the hidden. I would just uh, say everybody bring a pockets using book paper. Or what? Yeah, what I would say just bring um, a lot of book pages, glue. We won't worry about too much about decorating. We'll concentrate more on making hidden packets, um, stuff like that. I might have to go back through the post. Have you tried okay. One Sheet Wonder to help you get through your 12 by 12 paper stash? <clears throat> I'm not sure. Have you tried One Sheet Wonder? Is that a name? I'm wondering if that's making a YouTube like channel, up some, like a little journal or folio or something out of one Night wrap. 12 by 12 paper, maybe. Good night, Lorette. I don't know. Esme, you can craft with us anytime. I'm about to play with you guys. <laughs> yeah, she ha she has to um get StreamYard though. I think I don't know if she got it yet. Oh, that's right. Oh, awesome, Krista. We have to help her um, get into StreamYard, and then she can then we can just invite her in when she wants to come in. Okay, that's my cardboard. That's my altered pizza box. <laughs> oh, no worries, Esme. There's my pizza box. Better than the pepperoni. Wow, look at all you did. Holy <laughs> moly. And I did not go fast, girls. Did I go fast? I was just playing. No, you didn't. No, you didn't go real fast. But I mean, they're not there. I, um, I mean, there's only one, two, one three, four, five, six things done there. Hi, Cheryl. One piece of paper. Many videos on the one sheet. No wonder. I've never heard of that. Have you? I'm going to have to watch the one sheet wonder. Yeah, nope. I'm gonna have to, I'll have to check it out, too. I have plenty of 12 by 12 paper that I don't even use anymore. Yeah, really. I just have too many, you know, digital Thank kits. You, Rudy and Joanne. Try to do something with. Thank you, Cindy. <clears throat> All right. So next Tuesday night we'll be on my channel. We'll we'll put um we'll put something out to let you know what you need if you want to play along once we decide for sure what we're doing. I have to try that. One okay, sheet so. wonder. Alrighty, guys. So Patty's on it Thursday. Anybody on tomorrow? That you know of? Because you're better at this than I am. On Wednesday. Or how? Yeah. Um, Susan Taylor Brown's on Wednesday afternoons at. I want to say it's through. To three o'clock Eastern Standard Time. Oh, Esme's going to go live on Facebook after when we stop. Oh, okay. All right. So we're going to stop we'll, in a couple uh, minutes. And I think Patty thought about yeah. going. Isn't Patty going live tomorrow in the day? Um. Oh yeah, yeah. She so, was planning on it. Yeah, around keep an eye out noon time her. Eastern Standard yeah. Time. Yeah. I've just I haven't talked to my daughter. I'll have to call her now in the morning and see what she's going to do. She's going to try for noonish, she said. We'll be done before Susan goes oh. on. Okay. It's a good thing you remembered okay. that. Because, God, my, my memory. You were thinking about cardboard. Cindy says your cardboard no, is nice. <laughs> <laughs> night. Good night, ladies. Good night, everyone. Okay, I guess. Yep. Good night, everybody. Stay safe, stay positive, and yep. we'll see you next week, if not in between. Right. Take care. All right. One.
one. 